Hi, I'm Captain Brian Fancher with Texas Fishing Tips. This is your weekly fishing report. Well, our winds have subsided a little bit and we're getting some beautiful days with, with a lot of sun, some high pressure, and uh, very little clouds. So, what I'm looking at doing right now is I'm working this area in the farther end of Baffin. Now, when you get up here in the White Bluff, Black Bluff, and farther up toward the Pirate Landing, you're looking for drum, redfish, and a few trout, but mainly your drum and reds. Now up in here in this cove, I really like looking for drum. Now, my favorite way of catching them right now is with a uh, bare hook with a little either split shot or a half ounce sinker on there, and a shrimp. Now, I like hooking them through the tail or through the head, however you prefer, and work it towards the bottom. There's very few rocks in that general area, but there's some, so target that area. Look for rocks, look for sand pockets, throw your shrimp up in there, and the drum and the, will, uh, and the reds will find it. Now, other thing I like doing is come around Clayburg, and this sandbar right here is one of my favorites to get out and weigh. We're finding trout and redfish along in there, and if you hit the deeper end on the drop-off, you'll find the drum in there as well. Uh, work a uh, sand eel, something bright right now I like, a, a white with a chartreuse tail or a uh, cocoa minnow, uh, again a bright colored one, and just work them along kind of at a medium pace bumping them off the bottom there. Uh, go to right now also is a gold spoon, uh, always works well for redfish. Now on this end of Clayburg coming in, there's a lot of reds that will hang up in there and uh, I suggest you uh, sight casting at them with a gold spoon or again a, a jerk shad is another uh, hot ticket item right now. Uh, six inches, split tail, uh, no weight on there, flip it up and jerk it along the redfish will find it and they love it. There's some more trout hanging around tide gauge uh, up near the cabins in this area. If you get on the bar and work the outside edge of the bar, throw your croaker if you're using live bait. Uh, right on the outside edge, it's about nine foot deep, and that drop off is where you'll find some trout. Um, for you uh, non-boaters, right now the surf is producing pretty good. There's a lot of trout to be found in about the second gut. Um, look in the uh, uh, fish pass jetties, as well as Bob Hall and Horace Caldwell. They'll be holding a lot of trout out there. I, again, I like using croaker in the surf, and that's how you'll get your big trout this time of year. Now don't forget to go to TexasFishingTips.com to register for our weekly t-shirt and tackle giveaway and trolling motor brought to you by Gulf Coast Marine. I'm Captain Brian Fancher and thank you for watching.